Welcome everyone, in order to play Xbox games on your iPad Pro, just make sure you have an Xbox console. And on the console itself, I want you to open up the settings app. Then you're going to navigate to devices and connections, then click on remote features. Then just enable remote features right there, wait for the uh, speed test to finish and you'll be good to go. From here, you're going to go on your iPad Pro, you're going to load up the App Store and you're going to download the Xbox app. You're going to open up the Xbox app. From here, when you open up the app for the very first time, it will ask you to sign in with your uh, Microsoft ID, use the same account details as on your Xbox. Then you tap on this icon at the top right, and then you see here your Xbox Series S. Just tap Remote Play on this device, tap on Continue, and just like that, you'll be able to play Xbox games on your Xbox console. So I've used Xbox Series S, but any console, which is Xbox One or newer, will work perfectly fine. You will see this message, it asks you to connect your Xbox controller directly to the iPad Pro, this is optional. And then from here, your screen of the Xbox is going to be mirrored uh, to your iPad Pro. So you can see right here, settings is highlighted. If I switch to Black Ops 3, same shows up. Even if I open up games, boom, I'm in Black Ops 3 and it's showing up on my iPad Pro. For best results, you want to have the same Wi-Fi network on your iPad Pro as the uh, Xbox console you're using for the minimal amount of lag. Do keep in mind though, you don't have to be on the same Wi-Fi network. If your Wi-Fi network is fast enough, you could play this anywhere in the world. You could be in a different country, no problem. But you can see here, everything's running. This is running at smooth 60 FPS on iPad Pro. With that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. If you want to connect your Xbox controller, check out the video on the end screen. Bye-bye.